Hi there, this is my lock. Um, this kick cylinder, as we can tell from the, the little symbol here, is a Schlage Everest. Um, there we go, there's the there's the key. We can see the little symbol on the key as well. Um, now, I don't see any harm on advertising the fact that it's an Everest on the key. I don't think it's a clever idea to put it on the lock. Um, it means it's advertising exactly what is in this lock, which, other than the little check pin, isn't a whole lot. There's <laughs> uh, the tensioner. We will use top of the keyway. Um, I've been having a bit of a problem with this lock. It's uh, I seem to have lost the touch for, for standard pins somewhere along the way. Let's try and be gentle with these pins. Try not to overset anything, just... What's needing done? There we go. So we've got a bit of core rotation there. Uh, so that means we are trapped on this uh, little check pin. So get a shallow hook, move it to the back, and then as we pull it forward, we can feel that little check pin, and then just rotate the the tip of the pick, lift it up. And we are in. So there we go. This has been a camera shy lock. Um, I think I'm just maybe a little bit too rough with these standard pins, lifting them a little bit too high and oversetting them. Um, I'm not going to to get this because there's there's not really much to see other than that little check pin. Uh, it's six standard pins. You know, there's no doubt about that. Um, and we can see this little check pin through this little window here. So if I if I put this uh, pick in, slide it to the back, and then pull it forwards until we sort of feel it dropping into the the chamber where that is, we can see that little check pin lifting out of the way as we rotate the the pick. So that's all really that's required to to get that. Once you've once you've got the standard pin set, that's it. Um, and as far as I know, it's always located in the same spot between pins four and uh, sorry, between pins five and six. Um, there we go, Schlage Everest. Um, Certainly, <laughs> the primus the the primus is definitely a different kettle of fish, um, but yeah, there's nothing too difficult about this uh, Schlage Everest. Other other than you know the the subtle feedback from uh, from those standard pins. Give me a spool any day. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good one. Cheers.